what is up you guys so today I'm just doing like a little vlog I mean I didn't want to do a vlog I wanted to do um a video on the Yee app but if you don't know what the Yee app is the Yee app is like an app where you can get on line and you know video chat with people um yeah you can video chat with people and like as if you're like on FaceTime or whatever but I decided not to do that because you know when I actually went to go and do it I actually remembered that I'm like um anti-social so I was just like yeah that's not gonna work out you know anyway I'm not gonna do that video right now but I will be doing it um one day <laughs> I don't know when but one day right now I am about to wash some clothes this is my laundry room you know so yeah I'm about to do some laundry and you can watch me do that but I have to like I have to sort my clothes out but yeah I'm just like I want to do a vlog and I just want to do something like put out a video because I didn't put out a video and I said that I was going to and I don't want to keep going back on my words so yeah I know they usually say like for like new YouTubers or people I mean new YouTubers or people that don't really do YouTube not to um do vlogs because no one knows you and no one actually really care about your vlog or care about like the life beyond YouTube people really don't care but I don't care who don't watch it so if you want to watch hey if you don't see you later so how are you guys doing today Oh really? That's nice. You know, I just and oh my gosh, y'all! I've been getting readers like all this week, like since Sunday. So I've been getting readers every single day since Sunday. I think I'm addicted. Readers there, freaking Italian ices. Actually, I've been getting, I've been getting, uh, what is it? Cotton candy, confetti, blendini y'all it's so good it's so delicious the sprinkles is literally the custard and the Italian ice cotton candy and the sprinkles mixed I love it y'all let me tell you this story of how I almost kidnapped somebody's dog like two weeks ago <laughs> so okay so I'm leaving I'm about to go to my grandfather's right the dog was such a cute little like it was like white and oh my gosh it was like a white fluffy little dog I don't know what type of dog it is because I'm not really good or big on what kind of dogs dogs are like I, I don't know I don't know so I see the little doggy right y'all and I'm just like oh my gosh <laughs> like the dog is so cute but then I realized that I don't see an owner walking behind the dog and the dog is walking like in the gutter and I'm just like like where is the owner I call my sister and I'm like I found a dog and she like you found a dog what it look like I'm like it's a little tiny little dog but it looked like it don't know anything about the streets like it don't look like it know anything about the streets it looked like it literally just ran away and I started I pulled off right and my sister was like no go back get the dog put the dog in your car bring the dog to me right she didn't want the dog right but she was going to take it to the SPCA and get them to scan the dog because 9 out of 10 because that dog looked like it was well taken care of it should have a chip in it right they usually like put chips or something in the dog so they can like be able to find the dog's owner so she was just like just bring the dog to me and I did I mean no I didn't hold on wait <laughs> wait what no I did not steal the dog so I circled back around the block and the dog was standing at this point the dog was on a curb and it was walking like up past the past the um houses so I'm like hey doggy and then I'm like talking to my sister on the phone I'm like I'm kind of scared to even touch the dog because I don't want the dog to bite like to bite me you know some dogs will get like scared and like try to like snap at you I don't want the dog to like snap at me so I'm just like I'm kind of scared to touch the dog I would rather for the dog to, for me to be able to like lead the dog to my car like come on get in the car get in the car instead of me picking the dog up 
you know so I'm like trying to see if the dog is nice and I'm like rubbing the dog like hi you know talking to him or talking to her and then um, I'm, my, I'm my sister's like hold on what you say the dog look like again and I told her exactly what the dog looked like and she said wait I think I know exactly what like where that dog home is so she's explaining to me like where to take the dog to so I'm just like okay all of a sudden I see a man come up the street with a with a lawnmower so I'm like he's like hello I'm like hi and I'm still talking to the dog and I'm still looking around like where is the dog owner like well like what house and she's still explaining to me where to take the dog <laughs> so I'm just like he's like so he um look at the dog and the dog look at him and he opened up the gate and I was like and the dog go in I said oh this is your dog and she, he said yes I said oh I was just trying to find its owner <laughs> but I could have honestly almost kidnapped a dog by mistake because I would have took him from in front of his house I didn't know that from in front of his house took him to my sister my sister would have took him to the SPCA which the SPCA would have gave him back to the owner I was trying to do something good but I literally almost kidnapped somebody's dog yeah the time that I almost became a criminal by mistake hold me close till I get up time is barely on our side What's left? The storms we chase are leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. But I said I was gonna give y'all an update on my weight loss journey, and honestly, I haven't been working out for like a week. I have not worked out in like a week, y'all. So, um, my weight loss journey kind of like plateaued. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to show y'all what I'm looking like. It's not, honestly, a big change. I don't see a big change, but, yeah, I kind of, like, slowed down. But, it's not a big change at all. I'm still chubby. I'm still a little thick in the waist, y'all. Still thick in the waist. But this is it. This is the booty. This is the belly still chubby no different no difference okay none at all but um see this yeah I need to I need to get it together I need to be consistent y'all I just I, I don't know maybe I need to like play music or something like that I don't know but um <laughs> like i really don't that motivates me to actually work out or something don't drop that dun 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 hey don't drop that dun 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 don't drop that site <laughs> and i'm gonna get i'm gonna get back on it i'm gonna get back on my game i'm gonna get back to doing something getting it together what was i gonna talk about i was gonna talk about something else but i honestly i forgot <laughs> I forgot what I was going to talk about. I, my mother actually bought me a wardrobe closet. And I need to get it. It needs to get put together. I wanted to do it myself. My mother left. And she said that, um, yeah, no. Because it's heavy and you need someone to help you. Because it's, it's heavy. And it is. Y'all, it's heavy because she helped me bring it down the steps. And it was just like... It was heavy so I might do that next video I might put it together next video um I'm gonna see if she can help me <laughs> which I'm sure she will I'm sure she will help me um I'm not a builder person I'm not um I'm not a builder I'm not but I most definitely needed this wardrobe closet um because I have like a lot I have a lot of clothes. I have a lot of clothes. I have a lot of shoes. I have, as y'all can see, these are my shoes. And these shoes right here, this is not all of my shoes. As you can see behind me, that's a whole bookshelf full of shoes. That's not even all of my shoes. This right here is not all of my shoes either. But here go some more shoes. Right? Y'all, that's not all of my shoes. I have a whole tote full of shoes 
a whole long tote full of shoes which is over in this area I don't want to show that area because that's where I'm going to put the closet and that's where all of my clothes are my jackets I got two boxes I got a tote full of jackets I got a box full of jackets but I can show y'all but this is it this is my jackets and my personal items which I might have I, I'm going to have to throw those away my bag whatever and then this is clothes all of this is clothes this is night clothes right here this is shoes but it's a long tote so this tote right here is shoes <sighs> y'all I got a lot I have I do have a lot a lot of clothes a lot of shoes <coughs> oh bless me it's not corona Hmm. But um, yeah, I have a lot of clothes, a lot of shoes. But she ended up buying me the wardrobe, which I highly do appreciate it. Thanks, mom. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna be decorating my living room area soon, and you guys will see that. I'm excited. Um, it's gonna be a little bit before my birthday. My birthday is July 31st. So um, if you wanna cash at me. <laughs> Yo, those people that be like, cash at me some money, I just be like, I mean, I guess it's cool if you actually really, really like know the people for real, but I don't know. They be like, cash at me, I'm gonna go on a trip, cash at me some money, support my trip for my birthday, you feel me? But no, don't cash at me, y'all, don't cash at me, unless you want to. <laughs> If you want to cash at me for my birthday, you sure can. I'll take it. I'm taking donations for my birthday. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I'm going to I'm going to decorate my living room area, my living room area right now. I got my little living room. You know the the setup that I usually have with the um the colorful background. That's my living room area. And um that's all I got. I got that. I got a uh, rug. I do want to show you, but I really don't like it. I really don't like my living room area right now. Um, because it's not finished. But when I go to decorate it, you guys will see the unfinished and finished version of my living room. So, yes. Yeah, I'm excited. Because soon, like really soon, I'm going to do my living room. And it's going to be... It's going to be cute. I feel like it's going to be really cute. Hopefully, I don't have to put my wardrobe in my living room area, y'all. Because when I tell you this wardrobe is, like, really tall. And I have, like, a thing that come down over my bed. But I wanted to put my wardrobe. If you can see. If you can see this. You see this thing right here? It, it's low. Lower than the rest of the ceiling. And I wanted to put my wardrobe under it right next to my bed. But I don't even know. I don't even know if I can do it. Because this wardrobe. Let me show you how tall this wardrobe is. But look at the box. This is how tall the box is. My mother information is on there. So yeah. But this is how tall the box is. I did not want. I want. I, she's saying that she think it's just the box that tall. And it's not actually the actual item. But let's just hope that it's not the actual, the actual wardrobe that is that tall because I don't want a real tall wardrobe I want to be able to put it under right next to my bed so yeah anyway I don't want to talk too much talk you guys talk to you guys too much um I'm about to just like finish cleaning up and I will see you guys next week bye Like, no, I gotta do the over. Hold up, wait, wait, wait. Because that wasn't for real. I was just playing. Okay. Anyway, see you guys next week. Bye.